Hey everybody, Mike, December 1st, what a beautiful day in southeastern Wisconsin, about 40 degrees, 45 degrees, no wind. I uh, thought I'd set up um, a little park in an area called North Prairie. thought there'd be a lot here, but I don't know, it's just kind of a bunch of trees and edge of a woods, but like this spot right here and that's probably going to be what i'm going to do try a minimal color uh, palette something quick i've got a lead white primed panel canvas panel so that should work good for staining and uh, lifting off paint quickly so let's go Alright, well I put on that real uh, terpy wash of some transparent red oxide and uh, with the lead white prime it's very smooth and you can wipe off uh, the paint and get back to a pure white canvas. So uh, still pretty wet but I uh, got my basic uh, block in done, come with some of the main branches but it should be pretty straightforward, not looking for anything special. Want to knock this out in about uh, 45 minutes. Alright, in the ever never ending uh, world of changing light, yes, we have a cloud that just magically appeared. <laughs> Hardly any other clouds in the sky. But, uh, so I'm kind of blocking in that red area back there. Real loose you can never get every twig in so just kind of putting in some big chunks of color uh, even though it's 40 degrees the paint's still holding up a little bit it is getting stiffer and uh, kind of drying fast which I like but um, it'll be very abstract as we go here so squeeze out a little more color and uh, start putting on some lights One of the ways to cut in some of that, uh, never every tree, but some of the sky um, that's peeking through there is just to load up a brush with some very light sky color and just pick some spots. They're pretty much vertical lines just put in a couple of marks indicating there's some sky back there so it's kind of heading in the right direction paint's getting a little stiff but uh, yeah, it's fun to be out on a December 1st, Southeast Wisconsin. Another way to use that palette knife, you can get some really nice fine uh, uh, branches just by using the edge of the knife and uh, helps clean up some of the more realistic branches grass too. You can use that palette knife to just scrape away a little bit of grass. So that's uh, that's my little piece here. That's Mike. See ya.